Being alive means that we're just sort of planted here and are forced to make the best of what surrounds us. We're kind of like a tree. We sprout and hope the soil under us is good. We hope to get decent sun and rain. But one day, someone might chop us down and there's absolutely nothing we can do about that. Now, as humans, we have a bit more control over what happens in our lives, but surprisingly, not much more. We might wish we had superpowers, but most of us don't. In this video, we're going to take a look at the top 10 things that we have no control over. If you enjoy this video, please help us out by giving it a like and don't forget to subscribe to Mindscope for more must-watch content. Starting us off at number 10 is the weather. Hurricanes, tornadoes, earthquakes, tsunamis, thunderstorms, etc. are all completely out of our control. Not even the most powerful human leader in the world can call off a storm best thing to do is to take cover and hope for the best. Number 9. Pleasing everyone. We might be able to make some people happy, but even if you dedicate your life to pleasing every person you encounter, it's simply impossible. There are far too many people that just don't hold the same beliefs or qualities that you do. Doesn't mean we shouldn't try, but sometimes you just need to be who you are and let others be who they are. Number 8. Making someone fall in love with you Don't we wish we had a magic love potion? That 10 out of 10 guy or girl that you've been spending weeks trying to impress just might not be into you and though that might be a harder pill to swallow than one of those giant multivitamin pills that get stuck in your throat for hours, you may just need to move on. After all, there's plenty of fish in the sea. There's a lot of science behind love, but it's also a natural process that doesn't lend itself to outside manipulation. That's why they say, love is love. There's just not a lot of control when it comes to this stuff. Much like how we can't control who we fall in love with, either. Number 7. Famine We've all heard about how devastating the Great Potato Famine was. Famine is something that many of us don't think about because we're lucky enough to not have to think about where our next meal is coming from. Fortunately, we don't live in a post-apocalyptic society where famine would be completely devastating. Insects can destroy crops, but no amount of pesticide can stop a drought or disease. Which brings us to number 6. Disease Sure, there's plenty of medicines out there that will cure many diseases, but the fact remains that many will still prevail. How much control do we have over a genetic disease? None, really. We can treat it sometimes, but we can't just wish it away. The same goes for cancer. We can treat it, but there's no official cure that we know of. When it comes to diseases, the only thing that we can do is lead a healthy lifestyle and hope that we don't get the bird flu or Alzheimer's or any other plethora of illnesses. Number 5. Our Bodies We can diet, lift weights, or just eat Big Macs all day and our bodies will clearly change, but when it comes to our body as a whole, there are things that we have no control over. If you're blind, you can't change that. If you're deaf, you're probably going to stay deaf. If you're born with no arms, then you'll unfortunately have no arms. Maybe I sound a bit dismal, but these things don't make you any lesser of a person. They're just things to cope with, rather than to change. Okay, so the final four items are absolutes, with really no wiggle room. Number four, change itself. Let's face it, you can't stop things from changing. Even since starting this video, you've altered your perspective on certain things. Even if very slightly, it's still change. Life is completely full of change. Some argue that change is what constitutes life itself. But that might be a bit philosophical for this video, so we're going to move on to number three. Number three, time and aging. With Einstein's theory of relativity applied, it's theoretically possible to move through time faster than standard terrestrial life if traveling through space at insanely high speeds. But we can't stop the aging process or time itself. Every single tangible item or being in this universe falls victim to time. Everyone and everything ages. Some people might age better than others. But we all get old. Number 2. Being Created do you remember being created? Me neither. That's because it just happened. Nothing we ever do can possibly change that. 
As we discussed, time cannot be controlled either, so going back in time to stop your own birth is not an option. And now for number one, the inevitability of death. This is both scary and humbling, or maybe you're personally not scared of death, in which case, good for you. But let's face it, most people are. And perhaps what they fear most is that the inevitability of death is the ultimate lack of control. This realization alone can be a life-altering perspective. Of course, you may want to end it all for one reason or another, but if you're watching this then you're still alive and you should try and keep it that way. Just remember, we all die anyway, so why not just give life a good try? So that's our top 10 list of the most relevant things that we have no control over. And wait, there's a bonus item. Traffic. Does traffic suck or what? And we have no control over it. So if you're sitting on a bus stuck in traffic right now, why don't you pass the time and give this video a like and check out some of our other videos. Thanks for watching this week's video and don't forget to subscribe to Mindscope if you haven't already. We'll see you next time on Mindscope.